So carbonic maceration, it's absolutely the reverse as distempting and uh, smash the grapes or uh, fouler uh, the grapes. It's, it's used take with a full cluster, the full bunch, and all the harvest, you put it this way in your tank. You need an open tank to smell and fill it every day and, and take some temperatures inside if you are very precise, you want to be very precise. So uh, uh, what's happening, in, there is many things because if you, you can get in the tank to sponge down and so extract some juice during the fermentation, um, that will say it's half carbonic because as much juice you produce in the carbonic maceration, as much uh, 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 the dynamic of the dynamic of the uh, uh, process is different if there you have very few juice. Very few. Uh, I don't know. It's difficult to, to, to talk uh, like that about carbonic. Uh, it's something you have to see because it's full grapes and you have few juice. You don't do that much of uh, taking the juice and put, put it from the from the bottom to the top. So you don't do that much. You, it's, it's something, the best way is when you don't have to do anything. So the grapes just fermented, became wine, like, and you don't do any intervention. The temperature is quite quiet. The fermentation is regular every day. As Marcel Lapierre always, always says, we've done everything in the vineyard. We don't, do, we don't do anything in the cellar. The less you do, the better the wine is. So the, what is important, it's, we decided to press when the density is at the level we expected, but mostly when the color of the pulp is the same as the skin. Unitate color. When you have that, you, it's a moment to press. You will have a very, you will have a juice with the color of this pulp, and that, that's the third step, uh, step and the moment we decided to press. At this moment, we have a juice which is the, the la goutte, uh, what is coming just like that. Uh, we open your tank and then you empty your tank with all the, the, the grapes who are still uh, full uh, cluster, but mostly shot and, this, and other compositions that you had when it was the beginning of the, the fermentation. It, it is fragile and then you press it and you have the juice with running, which is ruby color usually, and that gave uh, the same, the name is the paradise, because it's wine with very beautiful ruby color, but just fresh fruits, it's not many alcohol, there is not many alcohol, so that gave a sweety red wine and something very good to say, paradise. And this paradise became the wine after all, after the, the end of the fermentation. But it finished the fermentation as a white wine, it is a, just in juice. It's, a, uh, it's for a lazy wine producer, winemaker, they say. <laughs> People who don't want to work and drink during the harvest to carbonic.